Hi boys and girls. Now today your job is to create a wanted poster for the giant because he left his boots but where is the giant? So your grown-ups will either have a um, printout for you to use or you can just make your own wanted poster. Now we did this for the gingerbread man so I wonder if you can remember what we need to do on a wanted poster. If you said we need to describe the person, then you're right. We need to describe the giant so that the people who are looking for him will be able to read your description and what you've written about him and try and find him that way. Now, is the giant small? No, he's very tall, isn't he? He's very big and he's very broad. Now, where does the giant live? In the castle. Does he have a beard? Mm. Yeah, fantastic. And you can think about other things to describe the giant too. Now, you are going to need to draw your picture of your giant. So I'm just going to draw his face. But when you do it, you can do his whole body. I'm going to add his fluffy beard on. And his smile. Eyes nose just like that here he is let's give him some ears as well there he is and i'm going to give the giant a little hat as well there is the giant now what i need you to do is write a sentence to describe the giant now i'm just going to add my lines on but you will probably already have lines to write on now, I think my sentence is going to be, the giant is tall. The giant is tall. Let's see how many words that is. The giant is tall. Four words. My first word is the. Oh, that's one of our high frequency tricky words. So I'm going to show you what that looks like in red because I need you to try and spell this word correctly because we've learned it before. So hopefully you can remember the. Hmm. What three letters do I need? The letter T, H and E. T and an E. Now it's the start of my sentence. So do you know what that first letter needs to be at the start of a sentence? It needs to be a T, but it needs to be a capital T because it's the first letter in our sentence. So we've got our T and our E. Now, lots of you are starting to join now, so you could have a go at joining those letters if you think you can. If not, don't worry, just keep doing your letters separately. The giant. Oh, the giant. Oh. What do you think you can hear at the start of giant? A j. Now, this is similar to the gingerbread man. It sounds like it's the j that we've learnt as j, but actually, like the gingerbread man, it makes, it's the letter g that's making that j sound. So see if you can remember that. It's the letter g that makes a j sound. Now I've left a little finger space, a little gap in between these two words because this is a new word and if we wrote them all next to each other they'll all become one word and we don't want that. Giant. Now I'm going to show you how to write giant because this is an important word in our story so you might be able to remember it and if you can't remember it don't worry you can use your sounds instead. It's a G I a N T giant the giant is is oh that's another one of our high frequency words I'm going to write it correctly with my red pen to show you that this is a high frequency word now can I fit is on here no so I need to go to my new line and go all the way to the left to start a new line is, 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 the giant is, what did we say? The giant is 
tall. Excellent. The giant is tall. Ooh. What sounds can you hear? Can you help me sound out tall? T all. T all. Tall. Excellent. I can hear three sounds. Now, it's a new word. So, what do I need next to our word is before I start a new word? A finger space. So, I need to leave a little space. Now, because I'm holding my board, it's a little bit tricky. But we need to put our finger down next to our word is and then start writing next to it. So I'm just going to leave a nice little gap. Tall. T. Can you see here? There's a space to show me it's a new word. Tall. T. Or. Oh, we learned that one recently. That's the letter R and R. Tall. Tall. What can you hear at the end? Oh, excellent. The giant is tall. <gasps> that is fantastic. Now, I've written all four of my words. So what comes at the end? Excellent. A full stop. Here is our full stop. The giant is tall. Now, I want you to have a go at writing a sentence to describe the giant yourself. You could use the same sentence as me or you can think of your own. Good luck and I can't wait to see pictures of your fantastic wanted posters. <laughs>